Here she is. One ported 501P custom full wrap. So in case you missed it, I took a half wrap from a 562, cut off the radius part, cut it here, rotated it. It bolts up down here. I just grabbed a longer, longer bolt. So it bolts in there. It's welded up top, welded over there again. And we got a custom full wrap. I think it's, I think it looks factory. You know, overall, I really like this saw. Um, it's very simple. It's a lot like the 7310 I just finished. Very simple, you know, choke, high idle, on off, you know, compression release. You don't really need on these kind of saws. Um, you know, the handle will undo the oil cap. It's just real basic. The cylinder layout was just like a five or a 372. And it actually looked a lot also like the 346 XP from the Husky. Uh, you know, the muffler is really easy to mod. They're already hollow. I just pulled out the stock little tube thingy here. Put a pipe in instead. Um, you know, I really like this little saw, especially with this full wrap now. I think that's really neat. Um, you know, they saved weight wherever they could on this thing. I feel like some of the plastics are really thin, but they're in areas that don't, so it doesn't really matter. The uh, hardware, some of them are really small. They're the next size down from what you'd normally see. Uh, let's see here. It takes a, a number three T handle, which normally I'm running a number four. But I think that just helps shave weight, you know. There's a small one there and bigger ones down there, and... Seems like wherever they could possibly shave weight, they did, and it, and it paid off. So I really like this little saw. What can I say?